Welcome back to a training of the Modicon M2 to 1. In this video, we're going to see the different software that we can use to program HMIs that will be connected to the Modicon M2 to 1. So first, let's go to the presentation and see the ways that we have to communicate to an HMI. So we have the Modicon M2 to 1. As we saw in the previous videos that we have uh, Modva serial and we also have an Ethernet port that we can talk uh, Ethernet IP or Modva TCP. So if we want to communicate to an HMI to visualize information from our plant, what we can do is to communicate over Modbus and the easiest way is that the HMI is the master and then the slave is the PLC. And if you are talk over Modva TCP or Ethernet, over Ethernet, we can use the HMI as a client and the PLC as a server. So, based on that, we have the possibility to use an HMI with, in, in, in a Schneider offer, we have BGO Designer and EcoStructure Operator Terminal Export. BGO Designer, I am going to cover that in another model. In this particular model, I want to talk about the EcoStructure Operator Terminal Export that has new functionalities compared to BGO Designer, okay, they are much better. So we're going to cover that along this training, this part of the training, we're going to cover how we can work with this, with the HMIs on, of EcoStructure Operator Terminal Expert and how to use the software. So based on that, okay, if we follow with the EcoStructure Operator Terminal Expert, these are the HMIs that we can work with. So we have the Starting from the bottom, we have the HMI SC07, okay, with a graphic display, color, and we can talk over, must, over Modbus serial or Modbus TCP to the HMI, uh, to the PLC. We can import the program from the M221 into the HMI to easily share the variables. We can do that with all these HMIs, okay. We're going to show you that later. Now, as you can see here, we have different HMIs and good something good that we can have of this is that this has the possibility to use something called um, Web Viewer, similar to the WebGate pad we can use in different browsers compared with VGL that we only have the WebGate for Internet Explorer. This one allows us to use another browsers. Okay, this model, I'm not 100% sure about this one. I believe it's not. We can check that later. So. This is the range for the HMIs. Okay, this is the range for the HMIs along with the EcoStructure Operator Terminal Expert. So, in this model, we're going to focus on the, in this software, how we can configure the PLC to communicate with the HMIs in the EcoStructure Operator Terminal Expert. And we're going to talk about the different licenses that we have and how we can see the HMI in a laptop using the web viewer. So, Thank you very much for watching this video and I see you on the next one.